you. Let's, let's try this again. Hey guys, Tigger, back on trail. It is February 13th. Oh yeah, back on trail. I uh, left Caldwell this morning. Uh, you know, so I didn't get my glove on. It's still cold out here. Left Caldwell this morning. Yeah, seriously. Hey guys, it's Tigger. It's February 13th, back on trail. Um, left Caldwell this morning. Got to hang out with uh, is, uh, Michael Edmonds. I'm horrible with names. Cool, we sat there and talked for about 45 minutes. Really good guy. Uh, MD Edmonds is his uh, Facebook. We <sighs> yeah. Talked about the trail, told about the weather and everything, what was going on. Uh, I had a lot of people get in touch with me um, over the weekend. So I'm super excited to maybe be able to meet some of these people along the trail. Uh, the trail community around here in Ohio, honestly, it's been pretty amazing. Um, some of the areas aren't that great you go through. Uh, the trail itself is easy, but logistics it can be pretty tough as far as like uh, where to get food, where to sleep, where to can get water, you know, good water sources. Um, but other than that, I mean, the experience has been amazing so far. I uh, can't wait to meet more people. I'm heading toward, I should be in Zor in five days, the 31st, Saturday, Sunday. Monday, maybe Tuesday, I am nursing a bad leg right now, so I'm going a lot slower. I also have to walk more hours, make up the miles as long as, uh, my leg feels okay. I couldn't stay in the hotel room another day. It drives me nuts. But I sat there and waited for the rain to stop. It was like 9.30 when it finally stopped. Got out, walked up, walked from Caldwell up to Bell Valley. Uh, got back on trail. Met, I uh, had a guy pull over a little bit ago, uh, David. Sat there and talked for about a half hour or so. Really good guy, like I said. I mean, everybody's been super interested in what's going on he said up where i'm going to there's actually like uh, this weekend i guess there's a a bigfoot convention or something going on <laughs> so he said he said there'll, be, there'll probably be a lot of people in the woods <laughs> which would be good uh it'd be interesting to meet some of those people but yeah i'm excited to get to pennsylvania uh just it's like that excitement of just entering a different state uh oftentimes you can tell like a geological change but uh, I'm just looking forward to uh, PA then knocking out New York getting back into Middlebury where I got off before and springtime will be coming get a little bit warmer weather get more Sun the Sun actually peaked out for a second uh, tomorrow the weather forecast hang on I keep saying this stuff I got knocking on wood now knocking on the telephone pole the weather forecast looks pretty good for the next week. I think the biggest rain day is like, uh, I don't remember, Monday or Tuesday. It's like 50% chance. And the rest of us is supposed to be cold and sunny. I can deal with the cold. Uh, the ground will probably freeze up. Might make the trail slicker. Get some ice and stuff, but we'll see how it works out. Yeah, just checking in with you. Let you know I'm still out here. Still enjoying the trail. I would like to see some more like uh, small, like historical towns. I love reading, reading landmarks and stuff like that. So, looking forward to that. I know Zor is supposed to be a really cool little town. At least that's what everybody tells me. So I'm looking forward to getting there. It's all supposed to be a trail town. So you better be ready for me, Zor. But uh, yeah, that's about it. Well, not much else to say. Just gotta walk. Talk to you later. Bye. February 13th. That sucked. 
my little portion of a woods trail that goes around uh, Wolf Lake, Wolf Run Lake. On the north side, is flooded outside of Bushwhack. <sighs> Ended up falling and pulled that muscle again. What I can do about it is I keep walking. I'll stop in a little bit, take a couple, uh, couple more uh, ibuprofen. Just keep on rolling. Just gonna take it easy, just walk into the night, I guess, to find somewhere to sleep. But yeah, most pretty much everywhere, it's just because of the rain. Any portion of the trail that runs along a creek or a river is pretty much flooded out. So be careful if you guys go out there. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Hey guys, still February 13th. This is Cooper Road at Beaver Creek. Ah, good. Three new boots on. I was hoping to have dry feet. How deep do we think this is? I'm kind of hoping a truck comes by, lets me hop in the back of it, but. Oh, crap. Let's check this out. I'm hoping it's not over ankle deep. I'll just keep on going, but it'll be a long way around. I re-injured my damn leg, so I'm hobbling anyways. Let's see here. Um, I might be able to go. Fuck, I'm gonna go get in that field. There's no fence right there. All right, be back in later. That's actually the road. And uh, yeah, it was more than ankle deep. So uh, I had to jump that ditch and get into the field and walk on up it. Uh, Hopefully, if I run into more stuff like that, I'll have a high area like this I can walk on. I'd like to go one day without wet feet. That'd be awesome. But yeah, I was worried about my leg when I jumped, but I did all right. I'll feel it later. <sighs> Everything's flooded, guys. Talk to you later. Hey, happy Valentine's Day, everybody. It's February 14th. Uh, I'm in Seneca Lake area. It's right there behind me. There, boom. It's cold out, as you can tell. Uh, snowed all night. I think with the wind chill, it's supposed to be, uh, well, eight degrees or something like that. But the sun is supposed to come out today, so I'm excited about that. Uh, my leg feels so-so. My hand is freezing right now. I'm just going to take it nice and easy. I ended up doing around 18 yesterday, which was I'm pretty proud of that, being that, you know, I think it's shin splints is what I got. Um, so I got my vitamin I, where it's handy. Covered it with Icy Hot last night, did a lot of stretching and stuff. And uh, just gonna move on down the road. Just gonna go until I don't feel like I can do anymore. But right now I'm gonna put the camera away because my hand is freezing, so I'll talk to you guys later, bye. Hey guys, February 15th. It's my first sunny wake up I've had in a while. This is where I slept. The road is a road right there. So I just kind of ducked in behind these hay bales in this field. But it's only 17 degrees out, but with that sun, uh, I say it feels tropical, but it doesn't. It just feels really nice to have that sun coming down. Uh, each day my legs doing a little bit better uh, with the shin splints. Uh, right now it feels pretty good, but I haven't started move, really moving yet either. I'm kind of screwing up my right foot though because it's making me walk different. Um, is what it is. I'm gonna try to do like another 20 today. We'll figure it out later. Uh, I kind of looked at the route. Doesn't look like I'm going by anything that resembles a restaurant or a gas station or anything like that. At least not within a mile. But uh, yeah, we keep heading out. Hope everybody had a good Valentine's Day. And uh, I'll talk to you later.